the car felt great even before the acceleration boost. This thing, this thing is no slouch. Um, you know, anything that's zero to 60 in under five seconds, I mean, come on, it's, that's fast. So, but you know, I'm, I'm excited to see like when I just punch it and feel the difference because I've done that before. So uh, yeah, I'm just waiting for my egg sandwich to get finished up inside. And I say we go for a quick acceleration boost blast. Welcome to another episode of Out of Spec Dave, where today I'm gonna actually test out the Model Y, the acceleration boost. Now, the thing is, this acceleration boost is only available on the long range. There is the, there is the car the, that you can buy with the, the shorter range. I think it's 279 miles of range. It's got the 4680 cells, the new battery pack that they announced on battery day. That's, you can't get the acceleration boost on that car. And you can't get the acceleration boost on the Model Y Performance either, because quite frankly, you don't need it, right? It's already boosted. Um, but this one here, because it's the, it's got the 2170 Panasonic batteries in it, the, uh, the 2170 cells, you can put the acceleration boost on there. Now it's $2,000 or 9,500 uh, 9, uh, um, referral credits, which is what we did here. But um, you know, regardless of how you get it, it makes the car faster. So I'm curious to see how, how this thing checks out. Let's, let's go for a quick blast. Well, here I am at the Rookery Bay National Estuarine, I don't know that word, Research Reserve. Um, this is this is over on the Isle of Capri here in Naples, Florida, just over the Jolly Bridge. And this is a place where a lot of people come and they rent kayaks for the day or paddle boards. And you can see over here, this is where the drop-in is. And these touring companies actually, you know, they, they're, they're making a living over here, helping people have a good time. Naples Kayak Company. So anyway, this is the 2023 this is the Model Y Long Range. This is my wife Kathy's car. This is, uh, we just got it recently. It's a white on white. It's got the 19 inch Gemini wheels. And this is the one with the acceleration boost that uh, we just literally, over the, over the air update, Kathy did it and she did a quick, quick little, uh, we talked a little bit about her impressions of the acceleration boost in the car. And, uh, you know, it was it was great to hear her impressions, but uh, you know to, now it's my turn. I want to I want to give it the beans. I want to actually see how this thing does with the acceleration boost. So that should be uh, it should be interesting. All right. So just to give you a little perspective as to where I am right now, um, you can see Key West is all the way down here. Uh, you can see Miami is directly across. Here's Fort Lauderdale and. Here's Miami down here. And this is the old Highway 41 Tamiami, Tamiami Road. And then this is the new, um, this is the new, what they call Alligator Alley, Route 75. And, uh, and so where we are right now is, you can see Marco Island is, is over here. And then there's this, there's this bridge that goes up and over, that's the Jolly Bridge. And then this is the Isle of Capri over here. This is kind of a unique housing development, boating community, really awesome place. And, and then where we are right now is we're in this little estuary that where they rent out kayaks and canoes and you can see where, where, where I am right now. But basically this is the boat ramp here and then you can paddle and kayak and you know, I haven't done it yet, I wanna check it out. But um, it's a beautiful spot to come here. I would imagine there's some pretty crazy wildlife around here, so I'd have to learn about this. But um, yeah, it's just a beautiful area down here. And it's just south of, a lot of you may have heard of Naples, Florida. This is, this is an amazing, uh, amazing town. It's got great restaurants. And uh, yeah, this is where we, we like to come. This is the southwest corner of heaven of Florida. And uh, Florida is just a massively big state. I mean, it, you, you can't really go much further south. Otherwise, this is all alligator country over here, the Ever Everglades. And uh, it's, it's pretty insane. But, um, you know, you got Jacksonville over here. You got Tallahassee over here. 
This is the pan handle, and we're all the way down here. So enough of that, let's go for an acceleration boost. All right, so in order to prove that we do have acceleration boost, what you do is you go over to software, and then you scroll up. We've got, oh, 3,556 miles on this car already. And let's see, where is it? Oh, there it is, acceleration boost. That's an included package. And then if you hit this little descriptive box, it tells you improved acceleration from zero to 60 miles per hour in 4.2 seconds, which is down from, I believe, 4.7 or 4.8 seconds. So as a percentage, that's quite a bit. And again, I'm not, I'm not hooking up today the, uh, the actual um, device to see if it's if it's 4.2 or 4.1 or 4.3. I just want to kind of feel. Is it does it feel like it's worth two thousand dollars? I have a feeling that I'm going to say it feels like it's worth ninety five hundred <laughs> referral points, but it probably doesn't feel like two thousand dollars. At least not to me. But I don't know. We'll see. I I I'm gonna let it rip. All right. So I got my hat bound backwards so it doesn't fall off when I hit this acceleration. Um, here we go. Let me just pull out here come to a stop and I'm going to punch it. Ready? Here we go. Oh, okay. I definitely feel a big difference. It's much faster for sure. Um, you know, it, it's one of those things that years ago I used to go I used to go to these stereo shops with my dad and we'd listen to these high-end speakers and you know and and you could listen to a twenty thousand dollar pair of whatever clips you know clips horns or you know some some crazy high-end high fidelity stereo speakers and and you could hear the difference but was it worth fifteen thousand dollars more than the other five thousand these these things are subjective i think on paper when you prove it out this car is definitely faster you feel it is it really worth $2,000? Um, if you're one of those people that you just gotta have the best and you and you got a little few extra bucks to spare, you know, I would probably say go for it. But you know what the thing is? This Model Y is so good out of the box. I don't think side by side, you're gonna feel like the value every time you punch it. I mean, here, I just punched it here from let's say 10 or 15 miles an hour up to X miles per hour. And, and and I definitely feel a difference, but it's not like I was wanting more. It's not like I was expecting this car to be so fast. Um, look, if you have two grand, it's not a waste of money. If you have two grand and two grand means a lot to you, don't spend it, my advice. Put it into something else. Um, use that to, to you know pay for supercharging or whatever it is you're doing. Um, but if you do have some referral credits and thank you to all those that have given me my referral credits, which gives, which gave us the ability to, you know, light this car on fire with the acceleration boost, then I would say absolutely go for it. Why not? Uh, unleash the hounds, if you will. Right. Um, and, uh, and, and just, and just take advantage of the full capability or at least the capability that Tesla gives you in this car. So look, with that, I hope you enjoyed today's episode on the acceleration boost. It's a short one, just a quick one. My feeling is if you got tons of money, you're probably buying the, the performance anyway, or maybe something even spicier than that. But look, if you got, if you're really into it, go for it. Otherwise, just be happy and drive your Model Y. What an amazing car. It's really good to be back down here in Florida and driving the Model Y. As I, as I go over the Jolly Bridge here, you know, this is just, this is just spectacular here. You gotta love this. Marco Island, Florida. Just if you ever get a chance to come down, stay at the stay at the JW Marriott, stay at the Hilton. It's just a fantastic place. And if you look over there, that green house all the way over there with the green roof, that's Eminem's house. And one of those boats right down there is not mine. I wish it were, I wish it were. But anyway, thanks again for watching another episode of Out of Spec Dave, and we'll catch you on the next one. Take care now. Bye-bye.